and today I'm back with another wig review. I know it's been a while, but let's get right into the video so we do not delay anymore. So today I'm doing a review on the Bobbi Boss Topaz wig and it is in the style L MLF60 and this is what it originally looks like. So as you can see, there is color on the ends of her hair and it's a little more curly. Now I've been wearing this wig for about two months now. So the curls are not gonna look like what's on the card as of right now because they kind of fell a little bit. And so yeah, they're looser and I think it looks prettier that way, but Initially, the hair did not particularly look this curly. I mean, it was that curly, but it didn't really look exactly like the picture, which I kind of was expecting it to be like that because that's why I got this unit. But anyways, besides that, the hair is awesome. So just let me tell you the specs. So it did come with wig Tape, which I do not use at all, which I do not recommend you guys use at all because it tugs and pulls all the hairs out of your edges. You don't really want that to be looking jank. Yes, I said it. And it says it has a handcrafted last last bed. It has a handcrafted lace patch, which is the um actual you know space right here for the parting and stuff, which I do not like. It has that artificial, unnatural look. And it says that this wig has premium fibers. This wig is meant to be at a side part, but I like my wigs generally as a center part. I just like the way it frames my face better. I don't know, I just prefer it that way. And I do have it in the color 1B. Now, a few things that I love about this hair is that it is easy to put on and go out the door. All you have to do is do a slight brushing, tussle it a little bit, and you're out the door. And it's unlike longer wigs where you have to like actually brush through all the synthetic crunchiness and try to get it to look decent, but not with this wig. Since it's a short style, you can just style it and go. Um, another thing I really like about this hair is that it doesn't look wiggy. It doesn't have that wiggy look, feeling, or shininess. Now on camera it does look shiny because my lights are kind of bright but in real life this hair does not feel synthetic at all and this hair does tangle a little bit at the ends and you have to expect that with synthetic hair. You can't expect synthetic hair to not tangle but this hair does tangle just a little bit at the ends but all you have to do is just brush it out and since it's a short wig it's easy to brush out and maintain and that's what I really really love about this wig and also the way I like to detangle it a little bit is to spritz a little bit of water on it and just brush and comb through it. That really really helps with detangling. Oh yeah the wig cap fits perfect and I believe it doesn't really say what kind of size cap it is, but it is a very, very comfortable cap. It's not too tight and it's not too loose. Now it does come with combs on the front part and it comes with the comb in the back and it has adjustable straps and it does not come with baby hairs, which you shouldn't really mind all that much since this hair is short. I don't, I don't really think I have any cons about this hair. I really do love this hair. Like at first, I could not get this wig to look how I wanted it at all. And I didn't really like it at first, but as I kept wearing it, it kind of grew on me a little bit. Yeah, that's, that's what wigs do to me. They grow on me, then I love them, and I hate them when they tangle. And not this one. This one, I have grown to love. Now, I wanted to tell you guys that it does come with ear patches but if you have it in the middle part like I do you're gonna have to like adjust the ear parts on the side because on this side it does poke at the back of my ear a little bit but it's not uh, too uncomfortable and also when I cut the lace it was kind of weird because the lace only came from here to here and the rest was free I only had to cut a little bit 
of the lace which I really like that about this hair. I guess this is with all Bobbi Boss wigs. Um, you can curl this hair up to 400 degrees. I originally wanted this wig in the actual color that it that the model is wearing but I kind of didn't really want well I did want it but it was out of stock so I just had to get a 1B and I forgot to show you guys the packaging. This is the packaging. This is what it looks like. You guys already know I hate it when it doesn't come in an actual box because these things are very very flimsy and they can like you know crumple a lot. The only thing that I don't like about this hair is the patch on the parting and that's about it. Let me zoom you guys in. So as you can see the part does look a little bit natural but if you like do this you can hear that it is very very fake and patchy. I really do not like the patch and plus this part right here does not separate so the part can like blend with your natural parting so that's the only thing I really don't like about this hair but otherwise the parting is very great. So as you have this unit the curls will drop like this. I will insert a clip from about a month ago so you guys can see what it actually looked like a month ago when the curls were all intact but anyways I give this hair two thumbs up a 9 out of 10. I took one point off because of the patch up here which I do not really like and this wig also ventilates very very well. It's not an actual cap. It has those like what do you call them? It has those ventilation sort of stuff thingies. I can't really tell what it is but oh yeah so this hair is the perfect summer style like the perfect summer style even though it's still on your neck a little bit you can always take one of these clips pull it up do a little twirly twirly at the back then you pin it and you're great for summer and just leave these little bangy bangies out although i like to leave a little bit less out but yeah this is how i was wearing it earlier but yeah this is one way to style this wig if you like and it just keeps all the hair off of your neck and everything styling tip yeah oh thumbs up this video if you want me to do styling tips for wigs oh i have some ideas that i think you guys would really really like yeah, so thumbs up or comment down below if you want that. And by the way, if you're wondering what my lipstick is, I'm wearing the NYX um, Intense, no, the NYX High Voltage Lipstick. And this is in the shade 12. And it is a brownie color called Dirty Talk. Very, very awesome. This is what it is. I love brown lipstick, you guys. Keeping it real. Yeah. If you guys have any questions about this hair, Please comment down below if you would like to see more wig reviews in the future, which will definitely happen. Just leave a comment down below, tell me how you liked the video, and subscribe if you will, please, and I will see you in my next video. Hi guys! Yeah, this wig is awesome, awesome, awesome. This wig is awesome.